ended up being here just because when I'm here, uh, I'm in the middle of life. I'm not living uh, near the forest, I'm living with the forest. And actually, I feel alive every day. If I'm not go and milk the cow, I don't have milk to drink. I need to take care of the cow, and if I take care of the cow, they give me milk. And I could give you pancakes. We're living here together. I'm serving them, they are serving me. And I love the forest. It's the best part of our life to, to be here and live with the forest, being a part of it. We are wearing a summer version of the Malung costume. So uh, the dress is made of linen and the apron is made of leather. And these bags are also summer version of the Malung's costume. And they're very, very comfortable. And yeah, it also feels nice in this environment to wear them, <laughs> I think. Just because this is like sort of how people used to be dressed around here, probably. So mm -hmm. it, it feels right somehow. <laughs> you feel a bit like extra well dressed, but at the same time, very, yeah, very free. Le and relaxed. Yeah. Really relaxed. And I think I am in my fantasy <laughs> when I wear it. <laughs> Even this is my fantasy to live here and wear the clothes from. My fantasy are back in the time when people live like this. Mm. Uh, my grandparents they get this place from my grandmother's aunt in. In 1975, I was two years then, and um, they were modern people. They didn't like this <laughs> way of living. Uh, 50 years ago, uh, people stopped with this because it's unmodern. It's uh, more comfortable to live in a house with hot water and electricity. I think the world today is so much um, you should eat modern things you should wear modern things uh, just because uh, a big uh, company have told you that this is modern you should eat it you should drink it you should use it that's because you are modern uh, and if you're not you are a jerk and you wouldn't fit in and it's dangerous to not fit in. So when I was 20 I borrowed uh, two cows and I moved up here for the first time and everybody uh, thought I was totally crazy. Absolutely nuts. So because I was living in Stockholm learning uh, theater uh, I should be an actor but I couldn't stand living a life in the city. For me, it's not alive. That's not my life. It's too far away. It's too far away from everything. Here I have everything. So the, the city life, I'm, um, I like it a few days, absolutely. Absolutely. I like traveling. I like to see new things. I like to, to get inspiration from other things. I like to, to see innovation, different kind of, of innovation. Uh, absolutely. So I'm, I'm, not, I'm not like this. <laughs> Sometimes it's very, very hard. It's a very long day. It's, it's hard physically. It's very, very hard, but for me it's harder uh, to work in an office. Uh, I like the way of being tired uh, in the evening. I feel healthy tired. I know why I'm tired. I'm tired here and I'm tired in my body. I'm not only tired here because I've been in a, an office and I don't want, uh, need to go to a gym and just run. I have 
all the stimulation here. Absolutely. And I get um, all my creativity could also grow here just because everything is, it's harmony. It's harmony in the forest. I feel more comfortable and more harmony with this old-fashioned clothes uh, in the forest, yeah. It's fit. Actually, it's fit in this way of living. It's, it's more practical than anything else. And the fall costume, here in Malung, they stop using it mostly in the 1870s. Uh, some people were using it every day until uh, I think the last one that wearing it every day was he died in 1919 it was very very important it was important then and it's important today I take the best from yesterday and the best from today so um, of course it's fantastic to have rubber boots. It is, absolutely. <laughs> I'm not a fundamentalist because not everything was good in the old way of living and not everything is good uh, in the modern, modern life. But I just pick and I pick everything that fits me and that fits uh, my life right now. <laughs> Actually, I'm afraid of, of how we are consuming the world. Uh, I'm very afraid of it. Uh, I, I'm doing it too. So I don't say I'm better than any one of us, but I'm, I'm very afraid. I'm very, very afraid. I think we, uh, it's important that we are, are stuck doing it. And uh, I think it's absolutely dangerous living that way. world we live in now. It's real. It's not real. It's everything is in plastic. Yeah, but it's. I like it very much. I like these big cities, but only if I can go and visit them and go home. Yeah, this feels like home.